Well, years after the Berkeley County Sheriff's Office shot and killed an armed woman in a residential neighborhood, the state has paid out her family. Blair Sable explains why they believe her death was avoidable and how much they settled for. Lawyers allege that Laura Lemieux would still be alive today if it wasn't for the use of an expired taser by the Berkeley County Sheriff's Office. Her family, after alleging gross negligence for failure to maintain its equipment, has reached an agreement with the agency to the tune of $90,000. People who live in the St. James Estates neighborhood in Goose Creek reported that Lemieux had been randomly firing guns one November evening in 2015 and called 911. Lemieux had been staying with a friend. Arms stick out behind the tree, firing a gun. I knew it was the gun because I saw the muzzle blast. The sheriff's office reported deputies had tried to use non-lethal force with a taser initially to subdue Lemieux, but were unsuccessful. When she then pointed her gun at a deputy, they shot and killed her. A lawsuit filed in 2017 blamed the use of an X-12 taser and its projectiles that had been reportedly expired for two years as the reason deputies had to resort to using deadly force. Taser discontinued the use of X-12 and its shells in 2012, and according to court documents, issued a warning that use after expiration could result in malfunctions and lack of effectiveness. In a filed response, the department denied the taser was used out of date, and deputies testified they had even seen it working on the Mew. We've reached out to the agency's attorney for comment, and I'm told the department does monthly inventory checks and replaces equipment as needed. For Live 5 News, I'm Blair Sable.